Good morning. It is January 7th, 2024, and we are here in Monrovia, Liberia. It's about 3.15 in the morning, and today we are starting on foot from Monrovia, walking all the way back to Bo Sierra Leone for the third ever Walk for a Child event. The team now is behind me, getting everything packed up for the first day. These first three days are going to be very, very tough as we need to push 30 miles today, 25 miles the next day, and 25 miles the next day to try to make it to the border in three days and make it back into Sierra Leone and push the rest of the way to Bo. My goal today is to bring you along on the walk that we are doing, but also give you insight into what Walk for a Child is. I will do that a little later once the sun comes up a little more and everyone's awake and we're alive because right now it's early. 3 a.m., very, very early. Um, I am a little sore, my hips kind of hurt. I'll explain a little bit too about some issues I faced leading up to this trip, health issues, things like that. But boy, oh boy, am I excited. I feel very full of energy and yeah, excited to get going on this journey. This journey will also bring me to my thousandth mile on foot in this part of the world, which is an incredible feat. Both me and Hindelo will accomplish that on this walk. But for now, we're gonna get all packed up, get on the road, and I will check back in in a little bit once the team and I start walking. Not sure how well you can see it, but we're somewhere in some kind of market area, but the streets here in Monrovia and certain parts are just littered with so much trash, so much more than I've seen in Freetown, which is kind of shocking. I guess I didn't really expect or know that it could even get worse than that. But yeah, the markets here are just littered with trash all along the road. It's very interesting. I met a man, which I should have filmed, but um, I just got too deep into the conversation, but I met a man named Jefferson a ways back and had a good conversation about with him, just about life here in Liberia as a young man. Very, very awesome, very nice man. So, so far, team is feeling good. I'm in the back, bringing up the rear. Everyone's up ahead of me. So far, we're feeling great. We're having a good time. I can start to feel a little bit on my feet, my toes, but I mean, I know I'm gonna get blisters and who cares? It's only 180 miles. Easy, easy. Let's continue. We are now crossing a bridge. I'm not sure what bridge, if it's the bridge that I remember. Hindelow did state that during the Civil War here in Liberia, back in the 90s, this bridge was a huge battle point because there was one faction that sat on that side and one faction on that side, and it was a huge battleground to get back and forth across the bridge. Hindelow did say when we crossed this, many, many people died on this bridge. It's kind of always crazy being in this part of the world and understanding the history, especially during the Civil War, of how many people lost their lives and how many places that we visit where that did happen. But we do our best here to pay respects and honor those people and we keep on walking. Sun's gonna come up here in a little bit. Probably won't film anymore till then, unless anything crazy happens. But right now, everyone's feeling good, feeling dialed in. Let's just keep on walking. We are now coming up on our first checkpoint. Yeah. Right up here, you can see there's one man manning the checkpoint. Good morning, sir. Hey, good morning. How are you? I'm fine, you? Good, good. Hi, far. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. 
There you go. Just like that, you're our first checkpoint. Now we keep walking. Hindelow's a ways up ahead. Right now I'm trying to catch him. Eventually fall back with the rest of the team, but we kind of just go in the ebbs and flows. If we push really hard, then we relax and then we push. But I'm having a blast. We're about, I think, eight to 10 miles in. The sun is just starting to come up. Absolutely beautiful. We got a couple cheaters in the group. Example A. <laughs> but the rest of us are pushing on. Team spirit is very high. You can see behind me, the sun is coming up. Man, it's just walking as the sun comes up in this part of the world is an absolutely beautiful experience. I'm grateful to have it not only today, but for the rest of the walk and all the previous walks. It's a great day to keep on walking. Well, there we go. It's about 7 a.m. We are now exiting Monrovia. Hindala, what do you have to say? Um, it's been a great morning. First uh, day uh, for a third walk for a child, and this walk is for mental health and uh, violence ending rape against women. We've just finished Monrovia, and we are so excited on this. Thank you, we'll see you in both. Wonderful, we're gonna continue on our way. A lot of our team is still behind. Hindala and I are leading the pack as we do. We're gonna continue on the way across the bridge here. I believe we're just over 10 miles. It's not even 7 a.m. It's beautiful. The sun is just coming up. Let's continue on our way. Coming up now to what I believe is the second checkpoint that we've crossed. We'll see what this one's all about and whether or not we can make it through. Good morning. Good morning, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Perfect. Uh, walking to go seven? Yeah. Yeah. From Monrovia. We're about 12 miles in today. When you read, you read to play. Thank you. There you have it. A lot of people, a lot of times, like I've always said, it's just curiosity. They're always, when they hear we're walking that far, they're like, are you sure? It's like, oh yeah. We de waka and continue de waka as long as we can go. Stopping for a quick snack. We're about 11, 11 and a half miles in. Hindelow just filled up his water in that last scene back there at the house. Feeling good. Legs are a little sore. I can definitely feel it, but usually how it goes is the first 10 miles are pretty good. 10 to 20, you slow down a little bit, and then 20 to 30 is when the real push comes. But if we rest this afternoon, we should be good. All right, let's test out our first meal in the village. Yeah. Wonderful. Very, very good. And we got plantains and kind of some donuts with some kind of chili spice on it. Chili spice is very, very spicy. It's very good though. Let's try a little, a little bite of the plantain here. Very, very good. A few moments later. What up? What up? Mr. How are we doing? How you feel? Sakibo. Sakibo. <laughs> Much more tired than I thought I would, to be honest with you. For sure. In what way? Um, sore. Hips are sore. Yeah. I feel like I need to stretch, but like, I feel again, like, it's just walking. Yeah, like, it is just walking. That's why I'm like, why am I doing this? Like, We're 11.3 miles in. Really? Yeah. Um, wow. But I feel it kind of like, not even my hamstrings, but right under like my butt. Yeah, that's kind your of hamstring. Back there. Yeah, I guess, yeah, it's my hamstring. But hamstring, yeah. Yeah, so 11.3 miles in, both Matthew and I feeling all right, a little sore, but 
keep on pushing, yeah. As expected, so we keep going. Mark, how are you doing? I'm fine. Good, good. How is your body? Oh, I'm good, I'm good. How are you? Mark good. is a champion because last time we did this walk back in 2021, the 540 mile walk, yeah. Mark did the entire walk. He was an absolute legend, champion. Man is made right. of yeah. pure stone. Yeah, and I'm here again to complete this walk. Yeah. Wonderful, wonderful. Yeah, so. We're continuing on our way. We're probably about 13 miles in. We're gonna keep pushing. The sun is coming up. It's not really hot yet, but it's gonna start cooking yeah. and it's no good for me. So keep on pushing and keep making our way. Is this the way to uh, Sierra Leone border? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wonderful. Thank you. Are you yeah, we yeah. St started in Monrovia. We go all the way back to Bo. Awesome. Walk on foot. Walk on foot. Yes, yeah. sir. Join us. Yeah. yeah. We walk all the way today, all the way to Bo. Always fun having a little conversation with the checkpoint folk. They always get a good kick out of it. We continue on the way. So we're still walking and look at who we found. <laughs> oh, gee. My bones are weak. Tibo! My bones are weak. What happened? My How are the legs? The How are the legs? How are the legs? <laughs> very good, very good, yes. <laughs> lago, lago. Oh. Oh. How are you oh. feeling? Mm. Oh. oh, how are you feeling? Oh, this rock is very oh. This is very tough, isn't it? Very tough. Yeah, very tough, but we only have 40 more miles today. <laughs> oh, no. We have about, we're like 15 miles in, so we got like 15 more. As you can see, people are dropping like flies. Thibaut, though, you've done very good. This is the most you've ever walked. <laughs> Thibaut will say now, after doing this one day, she walked 180 miles. Now she'll get on the bus and be like, no, no, I did 180 miles. Yeah. Okay, now we go. I'll see you. Craziness. Tons of fun, tons of laughter. Love the community we have here with our group and our team. Love it. Good morning. How do you do? Uh, this is the road to uh, Sierra Leone? Yes. Okay, okay. We did walk on foot from Monrovia all the way to Sierra Leone. Alrighty, we're gonna pull off here, take a seat, rest up. The team is just down the road back there. Once they get up to us, then we will continue on our way. I believe we're like 17 miles in. We got three more miles to push. The sun is coming up. It's getting very strong. So I really think we got an hour, hour and a half maybe left in us. I just know when the sun comes up, my skin starts to get really irritated and I don't want to push it on day one because we got a long ways ahead. So I'm going to take a seat, rest up for a little bit. Once we get back on the road, check back in. We are back on the road, stretched a little bit. Can definitely feel myself slowing down. We are at the 17.3 mile mark. Pretty good for the first morning. Team's behind me, spirits are high. My arms are starting to feel, I don't know how well you can see there. And my arm always rubs against my shirt. Not good. Skin gets very full of rashes. But this town here, it looks like has a huge marketplace. I don't know how well you can see it on the GoPro, but tons and tons of markets as far as the eye can see. 
normally, to my understanding, markets happen on Fridays. Today it is Sunday and there's no market. But when we were in a previous video in Jindema crossing over, the video where we crossed over the border into Liberia, it was Friday and Jindema was packed full of people. The markets were very hectic, full of life, full of color, all the things. But you can only imagine how crazy this must get on whatever day a market day is here in Liberia. But yeah, it's very cool to see kind of a really cool aesthetic with the uh, zinc tops covered in dust with the dust on the ground. It's very, very cool to see, but we're gonna push three more miles, call it good for the morning and probably drink a lot of water, pass out. I'm starting to get tired. Uh, yeah. What in the... Me selling the ground. Hey, you want to put it? Bring some money, bring two hundred to put it. Bring two hundred. Bring two hundred. Two hundred to my ground, Pedro. Yeah, bring two hundred. What is this? That ground? Yeah. How much? Two hundred. Two hundred. U.S. dollars? No, they want the dollars. What happened? You want to go out, baby? Man, I had to go out. What happened? It hit. It hit? Yeah. What happened to his hand? It hit. Don't, don't do it. Don't do my hand. Are you ready? Oh. You know what he said? Yeah. Do it out of the picture. That's not good. 200 for a picture? Yeah, Liwati. Okay. Liwati. I'm not taking pictures. It's okay. No. What are you all doing? Good morning. Yeah, good morning. How are you? I'm fine. Good. How is vehicle? Vehicle good? Yes. Okay, okay. Your name? Dustin. Justin. Yeah, is this the road to Sierra Leone? Uh, yeah, that's that road. It goes all the way to Sierra Leone? Yeah. Okay. We did walk up from uh, Monrovia all the way to Sierra Leone. Wow. From Monrovia all the way back on huh? foot. Uh huh. Where did it go? Thank you. Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, you're smart. We're 19 miles in. I feel like, uh, I don't know where mine is. Sorry. I feel like string cheese. I don't know where mine is. But that was one good push. 19 miles in. We got 11 to go. We're chilling in the village now, waiting for the bus to show up, hopefully. We have no idea where it is. We have no communication, but the vibes are very high. How do we feel? Weird. <laughs> <laughs> we feel wonderful, Dustin. Oh boy. Okay. Well, <laughs> how are the vibes? No one's. Yeah. Anything. Check back in <laughs> in a little bit. Whew. <laughs> Let me get my time. What's up, what's up? Timo, how you feel? Good afternoon. We have now rested. It's about 2 p.m. And we are hopping back on the road. The sun is very strong, which I am not a fan of because my skin is really turning red and getting very rash-like. But we have to keep pushing. We have about 11 more miles to go. And then we reach the town that we are staying at tonight. We push on, we do what we can, and we keep going. Uh, the one issue I'm having is my hips. There are nerves inside my back that are very irritated right now that is preventing me from really being able to sleep. One of the issues I faced earlier this year leading up to the walk is I had a disc, a disc inside my back along my spine that was completely herniated uh, earlier this year and pushing against my sciatic nerve and I got an injection, but that was about six months ago. So I can definitely tell things are not 100% and I have some irritation, but we just pushed through. It's very minor 
that's the worst thing that's gonna happen, oh well, we continue on. Till then, I will check in once we get further along the road and get to the town in which we are staying. Sometimes these vehicles get so close, I don't think my mother would approve of this, but it's a good thing she's not here. We continue. We have reached a bigger village and there's a big police checkpoint. I don't know if we'll be staying here or what the plan is, but we're about 24 miles in. I feel okay now, kind of just at a steady pace. Once you get up to speed, you can kind of stay at this like equilibrium point. It's just once you stop and once you start, it's hard, but as is anything where you're doing a lot of exercise. I'm hoping we can get some food because I've eaten very little today, but once we get into the village, I'll show you around, maybe talk to some people and see what this place is all about. Oh, Ay, wow. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, we are, hi, you are in town getting massages. Oh, so you imagine, oh my God. Oh, so good, but it's, <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Gentle, gentle. Oh. Oh. Okay. Right. Yeah, boy. Uh, yeah. Here, give me one second. Okay, oh. thank you. Oh, oh my god. Oh, it feels so good, but I, 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 I. Yeah, yeah. Oh. We go 40. Oh my god. Yes. Oh. Wow. Well, there you have it, folks. We are uh, <laughs> living the dream on this end. Uh, I'm feeling marvelous. I don't know about you. <laughs> oh, yeah, right there. I, I, oh my gosh. All right, we're gonna eat soon. I'll check back in. Oh. <laughs> Bruh, that's a lot of food. Oh, this is good. It's very good. Yabo! 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 Alright, we're gonna eat. Oh, thank you. Watch this. No. It's just Maya. Hello. Rosa. Hello. How are you? Good. How are you? Where are you from? America. America. America? Yes. Yeah, yeah. We did Waka on foot from Monrovia all the way back to Sierra Leone. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 How long? How long have you done this job? I've been here for five years. Okay. Five years. Why did you choose this? To serve my country. Wonderful. Uh, I love that. That's the answer we get from everybody. It's very cool to see. You like this job though? Huh? You like this job? Yeah, definitely. Good, good. Yeah. Pays good, good for business. Yeah. Yeah. Wonderful. Yeah. Wonderful. Thank you. We will be back. Okay. Good. Going for a walk? Uh, yeah, just walk. To the border. <laughs> <laughs> Good evening from, where are we? <laughs> that was gonna ah, do that. I have no idea where we are. We're somewhere, some kind of village, but uh, it's beautiful out. FDA is here. FDA is here. The Forestry Development Authority is here, but we got into the village that we're staying and then we took a nap. I feel pretty gross and my skin is not good. Sweetman's feet are not good. Yeah. But, either way, great first day. If we keep at this pace of doing 24 miles a day, we should be done in seven days, which is quite the feat. We're gonna keep on pushing. Right now, we're going for a little bit of a walk. Our bodies feel surprisingly okay. Sweetman's feet, I think, are doing a little more difficult than uh, mine are, but this is my third walk, so it's understandable. But we're gonna go for a walk, enjoy the evening. Just wanted to check in here and say thank you for tuning in for the very first day of the third Walk for a Child event. Tomorrow, we continue walking and get as close to the border as we can so that Tuesday, we can cross over to Sierra Leone and continue our trek into Bow. I will see you tomorrow morning.